Writing a movie is a tough task, and arguably the hardest part of that is coming up with a memorable ending to your story. When everything in the film has been leading up to this one final moment, you need to deliver the goods or it's going to derail the project before it even hits theaters. Sometimes the script will go through a few revisions, leaving some tantalizing conclusions that never see the light of day. Here are Screen Rant's five amazing movie endings that you've never seen. Terminator 2 Judgment Day Terminator 2 essentially ends its story with the hero stopping the creation of Skynet and preventing Judgment Day from happening. Still, James Cameron ended his sequel with an ambiguous shot of a dark highway as Sarah Connor questioned the future of humanity. Originally, things were a little more clear-cut, skipping ahead to 2027 when society is operating as normal. Sarah was a grandmother and an adult John was serving as a US senator. It would have been a nice way to end the narrative and would have made any more sequels completely unnecessary. Given how those turned out, they probably should have stuck with their first idea. I Am Legend The I Am Legend viewers saw in theaters was a very different one from the one they watched at home. The theatrical cut ended with Robert Neville sacrificing himself so Anna could escape with the cure and save humanity. But the original ending, available on the DVD, is regarded as the stronger of the two. That ending follows the source material more closely and sees Neville's arc come to a close in a more emotional way. He comes to the realization that the monsters he's hunting are living people with feelings and that he is the legend of their horror stories. It was poignant and heartfelt, and might have made it an elite sci-fi film if it stayed in the final cut. 28 Days Later Danny Boyle's post-apocalyptic horror flick painted a horrifying picture of a crumbling society, reinvigorating the zombie genre as a result. For all its terrifying scenarios and bleak settings, 28 Days Later ends on a positive note, with survivors Jim, Hannah, and Selena all being rescued. But Boyle preferred the original ending, which saw Jim die in a hospital after being shot, leaving his two friends to move on by themselves. Test audiences found it too dark, so the more uplifting conclusion was shot. The grim finale may have been more appropriate tonally, but after spending the whole film with Jim, it was nice to see him escape. The Amazing Spider-Man 2 When his girlfriend Gwen Stacy dies, Peter Parker is left without a purpose in his life. He's so depressed he even stops being Spider-Man until he watches Gwen's high school graduation speech for inspiration. In an alternate ending, Peter got emotional support from a different source, his father. Richard Parker comes out of hiding to be there for his son, giving Peter the encouragement he needs to keep moving forward and help protect the world with his abilities. The twist may have been jarring, but it provided a heartfelt moment and skipped over that bad rhino fight. We'd call that a win-win any day of the week. First Blood First Blood started the iconic Rambo franchise and is thought to be a great depiction of post-traumatic stress disorder in Vietnam War era. It was also a standout performance for Sylvester Stallone, who delivered one of his finer dramatic performances. The movie took its original ending from the novel on which it was based, where John Rambo commits suicide to escape his personal turmoil. But test audiences deemed it too depressing, and the conclusion was rewritten so that Rambo lived. Having the hero die would have been a somber way to end his journey, denying audiences the catharsis of seeing Rambo escape from his oppressors. And we wouldn't have gotten any sequels. Those are our picks for alternate endings that would have drastically altered movies. Are there any we missed? Which alternate endings are your favorites? Sound off in the comment section below and be sure to subscribe to our channel for more videos like this one.